sheet from Allie to the chair. Is that enough for the Miz and Shane? Yeah, but wait a minute. That shouldn't. There's no disqualifications inside a steel cage. Wait, wait a minute. That should not break up the count, ref. Start counting. There's no disqualifications inside a steel cage. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome everyone once again to Wrestling's High Marks, the highest podcast ever, ever. ever. with your host, Cheese Man. This is the Cheese Man. I get some Kleenex or an NXT Women's title, whichever you got. Mojo. Mojo is here. Listen, this is how it can work. And yours truly, G Wiz. Let's just call him G Wiz. I'll try not to rape <laughs> okay. for a few minutes. All right, this is Wrestling's High Marks, episode, what, 59? Ignorance! Change it! This is definitely episode 58. Yep, this is our Money in the Bank, uh, extrava fucking ganza, I guess. Sort of. It's also our Mixler debut episode, uh, so... That won't be a test. Kind of monumental, not to mention we're all in the same room and we should all sound pretty good. Oh, you know yep. what? Except for this fan behind me, that might be... Messing things up, but you probably won't hear that much. If you don't hear G Wiz's fucking blowtorch coming through, like we hear it when it's live, yeah. I think it's gonna be okay. Yeah, there might be some fan noise in the background, but the fact of the matter is this, people: we can't be wrestling's high marks and not be getting high during the show, or it'd be a ripoff to everyone involved. Yeah, we gotta so, have some exhaustion. We this live bitch. the gimmick. Yeah, exactly. Shit. Which I guess would mean it's not, it's not really a gimmick. A gimmick. <laughs> <It's> not, then. <laughs> We aren't playing characters. We're characters. <coughs> and I didn't even just hit, take a hit just now. That's just me working out the rest of the sickness. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're also doing a watch-along for Defiant Wrestling Loaded, episode 24. Yeah, we're actually doing this part not live. We'll be getting on Mixler later when we're watching the pay-per-view. We'll have some fun then. But for now... <laughs> It says here, the shocking finale before No Regrets. So I assume this is their go-home show. And that No Regrets would be like either a special or a quote-unquote pay-per-view type show. Yeah. That can't be right, because I thought it was their big pay-per-view thing that they're talking about. wasn't until June, I thought. Really? The beginning of June, but... Okay. Well... We'll find out soon enough, but that's what the show is called. That's on YouTube, as usual. Everything we usually do is on YouTube or the network. (coughs) It's not tasty, that's for sure. (laughs) We're uh, currently smoking really old weed to clear out a bowl. (laughs) Yeah, we're uh, using... We broke Albert out today, and Albert ain't been used in months. So this fucking weed's been sitting in this bowl for months. Yum. But somehow I didn't choke off it. Figure that one out. <laughs> Since Sensible Sam is my our friend on Instagram, and one of my I found out that on one of planet. her newest posts, I, I looked on her page, and it showed that she had with her new post was her 420th post. So nice. I had to leave a comment and say, hey. I don't know if you noticed this, but. I'm going to celebrate a, a toke for your 420, 120th post. Yep. Just Monumental like, post. I, I didn't know I had achieved that, but now that I have, I will celebrate with you too. I wish I could go back and see what our 420th tweet was. Yeah, so speaking of sensible Sam, she loved the intro thing that, that we used on the midweek, on the midweek munchies episode and, uh, I'm glad because I didn't really ask her permission to use her voice. I just did it and <laughs> hope for the best. So I'm glad it went over like it did. Yeah. And if you all didn't listen to hit, the midweek so munchies, go back and do that. I'm sure. glad everybody liked that. That was good stuff. I even managed to squeeze her into the greatest hits at the end there. So, yeah, good times. <laughs> all right. So that should have been enough time for everybody to get this uh, oh, together, don't you think? For sure. All right. Well, let's go ahead and get this shit started. Oh. We're going to all probably be depressed because if I don't think there's no Felchin Belgian on this episode Aww. or Justin Jism. No Jism or Felchin Belgians? Fuck. Well, I guess let's get this shit rolling anyway in 418, 419, 420. Simon! No Felchin Belgian? 
I'm sorry, I wasn't at the microphone at the time of that <laughs> statement being made, and I it's delayed outrage. <laughs> yeah, uh, I think that was the quote oh, I got so from maybe it is May, May 25th. So I'm hanging out with my lady friend the other night, and I come home, it's like 1 or 2 in the morning or whatever, and I see on Twitter that yuck, Nasty's like, we're live lover butts, and I'm like, what the fuck? Is there a get in the corner, and I hop on the Mixler, and there's like just me and Luke in there, and nothing I know. going on, and I'm like, what the fuck? I fell for it, too. I even retweeted the shit, and no. I was like, well, aw. It was YouTube. <laughs> they were live on YouTube. Oh. <laughs> uh, and the, the, they were doing... I retweeted the link to Mixler that he put out, and it wasn't shit. <laughs> they were playing Nasty Family Feud, and it was pretty fucking hilarious. Ah. But unfortunately, they had previously did it, and I guess the video game that they were using was using a lot of the old answers over again, and ah, so after okay. a while, they kind of knew what the answers were as soon as the category popped up. Right. <laughs> but for a while there, it was pretty fun, everyone helping out on answers and shit. It was pretty yep. fun. So, shout out to the Nasty family. That's Yuck and Jody. And uh, who was I hanging out? I was hanging out with Luke and June, who's one of the dudes yep. from the Get in the Corner. What's the other website yep. called? Oh, um, Discord. Discord chat. Thank Actually, you. I, I went to dis Discord the other day, and the Get in the Corner isn't even there anymore. So, like, I don't know if. Well, they got rid of it, or if right I somehow got kicked out, anymore. or what? I don't know if you know that, but it's true. Yeah, like if I go into Discord, it's I can still get into our room, obviously. Sure. And the uh, wrestling soup room, but getting a corner has disappeared. They I meant must to have ask you about that. Shut it down. Yeah, huh. I'll be damned. It was getting a little hairy in there. <laughs> trying to think who else was in the room. Yeah, but anyway, I was telling yeah. you guys that I was going. Damn. I prefer their Mixler crowd way better than their Discord. Yeah. Well, and also, there's not as many interruptions, and you can hear everything better. I mean, it's just, I don't like Discord as a whole very much because it's so choppy. Yeah. Discord did not work out well for us. Yeah, we recorded a couple episodes with it, and you guys remember them. <laughs> yep. They were so interrupty. The last one, I think, was the uh, interruption, ignorant, change it yeah. one. Yeah. It probably was. And at that point, we're like, we're going to have to go back to fucking Facebook. And back to Facebook right we went. On. Except for nights like tonight when we're Aguilera. actually all in the same room. <laughs> that, that, that really looked a lot like her. That's a good call. Yeah. And, probably and then she had the, the genie lamp here, on that top would be of the it. best looking one I've seen so far. She's a fucking stunner. <laughs> you look like you would taste like hot garbage. <laughs> oh my god, I totally taste it. <laughs> Who? Was that Pac? <laughs> I swear I seen Pac. And I'm not going to aid EW yep. anymore. Oh no! That's as close as I can get to Lawler. He's not place. laying down for Hangman Page. That's for sure. Which I don't know. Although I bet Vic would like to see that, if you know what I mean. <laughs> She's having the gay porn. Mm. It's a gay porn. What's the opposite of straight porn? Gay porn. Crooked porn. The gay community. Jagged porn. Jagged. Off. Rugged. Center porn. <laughs> Rugged porn. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what do you mean you don't think he's a real man? Do you think you could deal with that much... Anal trauma and just be like all <laughs> fine afterward? I think you'd be crying. Twink seems like it's a... Not a good name for that because like, he took a pound and, and oh, expect a Twinkie I to be mean, soft. Not to mention, there's nothing wrong with being slim and in good shape. Hey, it's Robix. Robix, all right. Yeah, being in shape's fine. Some people are just the petite. Cubes of shape. <laughs> hey, that. Moment when I realized I did not roll cigarettes. <laughs> I was about to say, like, uh, hopefully it's not that moment you realize you didn't hit record. Now, <laughs> who is Rob X? Hey, Wiz is across the room and can't facing... defend himself. Let's talk shit. Um, oh, I, I do enough of it on the show. A robot dick. <laughs> uh, 
Dr. Robotnik. Thunder from Down Under? Played by Jim Carrey. Yeah. Crikey. It's like, that's what Jim Carrey chooses to make his movie return? As Dr. Robotnik? Who's your agent, Jim? I heard his TV Sean show Custom. was doing real good, but then all of a sudden he's Dr. Robotnik. Uh, makes me wonder about that TV show. Was it doing okay? <laughs> Look at this dude. You, you know, he wants to be part of the Undisputed Era. Sign me up, Adam. Hope you're watching. Baby. Okay, it's Sean <laughs> Cumbum. Robix, um... Cumbum? Against Robix Cube. <laughs> yeah, Ro Cumbum. <laughs> Licky Cumbum. That's one of the most horrifying... Insults I've ever heard. <laughs> you fucking cum bum. Cum bum. Asking people if they have any extra semen you can have. So I've seen oh, Robbie X know. before. That dude, that uh, might be, that dude just, just rang me up which, at Speedway on the way here. Which one's the good guy? Which one's the bad guy? Is Robix Cube the face or is Sean Cum Bum? <laughs> I don't know. Wait, that could be another way too. He's got cum in his bum. Dude, you're look, that's just this is not a good thing to call a person. <laughs> well done, Mojo. I'm like uncomfortable having you in the same room with me right now. He should definitely team up with Justin Jism. <laughs> cum bum and Jism coming at you. Coming at you. Oh, no. Coming in ya. I went there. It's in your house. <laughs> hey. And you're going to have to work hard Damn. to get us out of your hair. <laughs> Dude, that fucking Speedway clerk can move. <laughs> and it's, uh, good to see Dominic Dajakovic Maybe they're is all both healed good up guys. and back in the ring, so that's good. Oh, he almost put his head up his cum bum. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> Drowning. There's a lot of wrongness in that sentence. <laughs> Which head? <laughs> Why is it already coming? <laughs> okay, uh, 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 fuck. What's it? Cumbum's got some moves. Uh, oh, damn. He likes to kiss Get him, kick people in the face. Who's the guy that does that headstand thing? The fucking dude with the tattoos all over his face. <laughs> you know what I mean, too. It's, uh... Uh... Dude with the tattoos all over his face. Hakushi. I don't fucking know. Hakushi. Oh, okay, yeah. From way back in the day. I'm thinking, like, more recent. Yeah, oh. the dude that, uh... Okay, uh... Brett Heartbeat and, and uh... Shit, I can't remember his name now. Or, I can't remember the pay-per-view. Doesn't matter. None of this None matters. matters. As long as everyone knows who Hakushi is enough to identify with the doing yeah. the head. He, he had the writing the all the way down the, his, the whole front of him, right? Yeah. Just like straight lines of writing. Mm -hmm. I believe his real name was <laughs> Lord Tensai. <laughs> Jinsei Shinzaki or something like that. Easy for you to say. Yeah. No shit. Come on, Robix Cube. I'm pulling for cum bum. <laughs> <laughs> pulling for him. Yeah, he likes to watch. Yeah, voyeur. Cum bum's finisher is called the hot cross buns. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. Fully aroused. I have a hole right in the crotch of these fucking sweatpants, too. I know it's going to be tempting for you fuckers. Whereas Robert's Cube's finisher is called the pulled pork sandwich. Huh. Hey, uh, speaking of that, I think we'll be eating those here in a little while. <laughs> Actual pulled pork sandwiches. Yeah. Not wrestlers. <laughs> oh, shit. Goddamn Bret Hart, take it easy. <laughs> Robert's about to uh, knock himself oh, out. Damn. And I was like, grab my balls! Twist my nipples! That's the old, uh... Ugh! Ooh, uh, rip off the nipples. Man, he's, uh... 
He's taking him some bumps. Yeah. That dude, that fucking science teacher can fly. Yeah. <laughs> Got that classic V style haircut. <laughs> Not only is he a real decent wrestler, but he's a wizard with transmissions. <laughs> he looks like a mechanic. So <laughs> wizard with transmissions. Little known facts about Rob XQ. Holy shit! Hidden pleasure is hit to be square by <laughs> Huey Lewis in the news. Huey Lewis in the news for some reason is one of the few things about the '80s I didn't like or I didn't dislike. Another one I, he's into I hear is Huey Lewis Jenny. in the news. I just instantly <coughs> think a bunch of different '80s movies that I really like, like Back to the Future and we're gonna go stuff back like that. in time. Ding, ding. I don't know that one. And how Michael J. Fox was actually playing a Huey Lewis in the news song on the movie, and Huey Lewis was one of the judges, and he was like, "That's too loud." <laughs> <laughs> Nobody wants to listen to that kind of stuff. You know, if Huey Lewis was a comedian, he would say, Huey Lewis and what else is in the news? Ah. Okay. That's uh, Andy Kindler. I thought it was like Huey Lewis and the anti-Semites or something. Nope. Oh. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> okay, well. Do you have any idea how difficult it is to edit a watch along? <laughs> nah. <laughs> I'm just saying, I mean, it's Huey Lewis, who knows? Evidently, <laughs> Robbie yet. What else is in the Jews? <laughs> Robbie's cube the Jews. is, <laughs> Huey Lewis is had Jews. enough. Jewy Lewis? Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Whoa! Was that the I think we might have un sandwich? uncovered something about Huey Lewis oh, here. Oh, no. It went from a harmless wordplay to potential offensiveness. Let's just yeah. move on. Damn. Sean Cumbum just kicked out of the pulled pork sandwich. Oh, son of a bitch. I don't know if if Rob X Cube can can what's, win. What's that he, wet he spot in Cumbum's drawers? What a move by Derek Young. <laughs> <laughs> Darren. <laughs> Whoa. That was kind of cool. Oh, Damn, and they just got the side of his head smashed in. Flap. Right to the ear. Slap. I'll slap you I silly can't hear. little bitch. Turn yeah. my last yeah. headphones up. Turn them shits up. <laughs> Motherfucker, box my left headphones. Turns that shits up. Oh, you thought I was going to drop it on that. Ah. Woo. <laughs> now you can't hear. No. Oh. 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 Uh, oh. Oh. Ah. That was a uh, botch. That, that was a... That was a bitch of a botch. It looked like it hurt his wiener and that guy's additional body parts. Yes. Something outside the wiener. <laughs> Poor little Robbie, and he does have a wet spot there. That's not cool, man. <laughs> it's like, uh... Ain't a leakage. You're trying to steal Cumbum's gimmick. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, I was like, uh... That was a weird setup, but yeah, whatever. To get to a tiger bomb, oh. and there's your two count. Yeah, kick his fucking head off. I mean, that hmm. dude can fucking move. Yeah. Cum bums can get around. Giggity. That's because he's all lubed up. Oh. Then he hits one of the huge frog splash. That's the big ass dude to be doing a frog splash. <laughs> and he still didn't win. Robix still kicked out. Well, he's already a little more expressive than Johnny Gargano. <laughs> Which, unless WWE is having another pay-per-view in two weeks, NXT TakeOver is going to get its own weekend. That that's only two. Cool. That's really? only two weeks from yesterday. I'm pretty sure. And isn't it uh, Johnny Gargano, Adam Cole? Yep, that's Cole one of the Adam matches. Cole gets to lose again. What's that, like 54 times in a row now? Uh, I think it's going to be uh, Io Shirai versus Shayna. Shayna Baszler, yep. Oh! oh fuck, I looked Ooh, down for a second. Dios mio, tu es muerte. God damn it. That's what I get for trying to be respectful and ashing the ashtray oh. now on the floor. Oh my goodness, again. This has been a damn really Robix fucking Q. rough oh. match, man. Yeah, this has been a good match. Dude's like, oh my god, concussion, concussion, concussion. 
Grab the kitchen sink from under the the ring, Robix. Mm. Yeah, Robix. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Robix. He's gonna miss this. Uh. <laughs> Not even sure what he was going for. Just something. Pele. Whew. Oh, that could have been ugly. Oh, he threw his fucking arm thing at him, his sleeve at him. What Whoa, the fuck? He reversed it into a roll up. You know he's not oh, getting out of that. No, it ends in a roll up. Everything ends in a roll up. Are we watching WWE? Everybody books the same. Oh, does that camera oh, wow. girl have a different outfit? Yeah, it's over, right? Yeah. Yeah. That camera girl's still wearing flannel around her ass. That bitch. The first word I seen was whore as soon as I turned on the captions. Thank you very Dropping much. Dropping eggs? Dropping Dro eggs dryer. dryer. Do you want to be a ring announcer? Please, please feel free to grab the sitting today. <laughs> Sore throat? Can't Rinsing help you. Rinsing comes to my fingers no, looking for the microphone. Rinsing comes to my fingers, huh? Rinsing. Oh, boy. Whose sister <laughs> feed to them? <laughs> Oh, uh, closed captions, you suck. Hey, will you uh, unplug that computer and hand it to me? It won't hurt nothing. It's not doing anything or involved in anything in any way. Thank you very much. Hmm. I'm going to see what I can do about getting us some pulled pork sandwiches. One of the best restless in the goddamn country. Restless. Now listen for me, this look at bad blood. Do you guys like yours with Between or without us, the star coleslaw? here eat. There's just pure competition. What? With or without coleslaw in your pulled pork? Uh, without. Okay. No southern slaw. Mojo? Side. Okay. You, Castle, wants to see the Robbie X's. Ready and willing. <laughs> you, Castle. <laughs> All right. One more time and many more off towards. Yeah. That's a handshake, a and that apparently you can seals your own castles and let other people. Okay. <laughs> you cast me. <sighs> oh, fuck. Oh, there's an Androtsev <laughs> in the background. Yeah. <laughs> Rusade. Androtsev. <laughs> Is it just me or are the caption words unusually large? They are a little big. I thought that. Oh, oh, it's Simon. It's like they went from our size to like Bobby Anthem size. Why? Why? Not the none that one, huh? Right, perfect. Okay, well, three. shout out to Bobby. Hopefully, you heard that one. <laughs> Yeah, we don't need to recap Simon Miller. <laughs> Shit, now he's gonna stay at the ring and talk. We got nothing to watch. So, uh, NXT sucked this week. So much so that I didn't it even did. write down anything about it. No, I didn't either. It cause... opened with something that wasn't great, I think. Probably finished with something not that great either. I literally <laughs> watched it two hours ago and I was just like, eh. Eh. Yeah, I know eh, Vanessa Bourne and Aaliyah were out there, so that was a fast forward. Yeah, we got fucking. Uh, there was something to do with the. Kushida this. and Kona Reese, uh Keith Lee, and. Yeah. And I couldn't care Somebody. less about Kushida because the shit they're putting him in the ring with at the moment. Right. I, I mean, he's he's working his way up the ladder or whatever, but it's like he hasn't even made oh, yeah. it to Cassius Ono. The yet. main event was the uh, tag team match that got. Interrupted and fuck finished. I kind of thought they were going to put Street Profits over on their way out. Nope. Street, or street Profits even said something like... They called him like 
the Viking Raiders or something like if that is your real name. <laughs> they didn't seem to care for that one. Wiz is over here writing a fucking novel. Hey man, I'm getting the food handled. Shit. Yeah, you're handling your pulled pork. We get it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in charge of pulling the pork today. <laughs> Tony Monson's on feta. Mm. Bad bones, the badness. You have been an issue right here in this promotion, especially when I was an assistant to General Armand. So May 25th, no regrets. One year since I debuted in a wrestling ring. Why? I'm coming after you. Okay. My biggest challenge in wrestling today. But if no one else can take care of a jock bigger than that debit, I'm going <laughs> to do it right. Because that's what I want to do. And I know you've got a match coming up, so I'm going to sit down right there with my good friends on commentary. And now it's been a while, and I feel I'm going to slap my head. And you know I'm going to end this with a why. Why is why. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> he did all slow and ridiculous. <laughs> I pat fell on head. I mean, sorry, I didn't do the uh, accent there. I pat fell on head. <laughs> I can pat myself on the head too, Eddie. <laughs> Woo! That mojo. <laughs> <laughs> There was a few of those drops last week. Mojo! Saw something about <coughs> like grumpy old man. <coughs> oh, the anti-fun police. Grumpy old man. Oh, these guys came out before already. Why are they talking about Crown Jewel on Defiant Wrestling? <laughs> Fair question. Even bigger boss, man. Yeah. Yeah. Boss man, Vader. How about the overly large boss man? That's kind of funny. Huh. The buffet boss man. The uh -huh. obese boss man. <laughs> <laughs> the o boss man. <laughs> the shops and the big and tall boss man. Oh, okay. <clears throat> yeah. This would be fun for you to listen so to when did, you come back from what editing. What did we call the guy that looks like a bigger version of Wilder? I can't remember. It was a cross, but it was another name. Dash Wilder. He, he looks like Wilder and somebody else, we said. Uh, oh. here, here comes the Macho Man. I mean, John Klinger. Macho Morrison. Oh, mm. it's, it's Macho Gallows. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna threaten Simon. Dude, come on. Come on. I'll tell you why. I'm not even afraid of the real Luke Gallows. So Wiz is gone. We've lost the female listeners for the time being. <laughs> Badness. Wiz is off to pull his pork. He shall return in a few minutes. We've been... Wait, Dangerous John Cena... Why did I see J Dangerous John Cena in the subtitles? I thought I saw that. <laughs> and then he said that. And I was like, he's like a Dangerous John Cena. I think he looks more like a Luke Gallows. <laughs> well, now that he's taking the bandana and glasses off, he looks way less macho. And oh, Crashing just walked in. Where's Wiz? Oh, he's not here. I'm leaving. Hotchner. <laughs> Crotchner is actually Hotchner. Wiz's little uh, Chihuahua. Chihuahua. Which that? I called Crotchner immediately. Man, I didn't know David Faustino wrestled. <laughs> no so that's shit. what he did after married with children. He's even got a belt. <laughs> Way to go, bud. <laughs> it's the Ed O'Neill belt. 
<laughs> you know, Christian my Apple dad did. scored four touchdowns in one game. Mm. Oh, Kai, that baby. doesn't seem to impress Dawson. Or Wilder. Huh. Whichever one they are. Slash Wilder. Slash Wilder. Oh, Macho Man just got kicked in the gut. Macho Gallows. Whoa. And for a big dude, doing some lucha moves. Uh, let's see. Looks like this should be mostly a hoss match, though. He did that one springboard. Ooh, no. What's up with your wrestling boots, dude? It's like <laughs> fucking red orange. Awful. Like Wiz's hair. Just awful looking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, was paying too much attention to Bud Bundy. Got the much got the chair right to the face. Cabase to the face. Oh, it throws in a few more chairs. But now Macho Gallows has got one of the chairs. Oh, it throws it right up against his face. A lot of chairs to the faces in this match. Two. Macho Gallows with the chair. We definitely have to back shit up because we're currently missing. While we're watch, doing this watch along, the pay per view is actually going, so we're currently missing the women's money in the bank match right now. Is that sure. on the pre show? Nope. 721. Oh, it's actually. It's, it started off the match or the night, probably. Started at 7? Yep. Pre show happened, though. The, uh. Usos took out Captain Planet and um, Wheeler. <laughs> well, I, I guess the only one that picked Team Planet was Wiz, and he's not here. <laughs> yep. I can come back and find out he's a loser! A fucking loser! Okay, what other match happened in the pre-show that we missed? Let's see. Keep scrolling, Did they have the uh, cruiserweight? <laughs> oh yeah, cruiserweight definitely had to be pre-show, right? Wait, maybe. Ow! No, maybe not. Now Slash Wilder, it's making his comeback. No, it looks like uh. Thank you. Looks like there was only one pre-show match tonight. Bye-bye, Crushner. Waze just came in and dropped off the pulled pork. I haven't watched any of this match, really. Oh, well, I guess except for the first, like, two minutes. I watched that dude just get dropped on his fucking head, though. That looked like it sucked. Man, Mach Gallows has really dominated this He's match the German the psychopath, part. huh? Mm -hmm. Oh. Essen eine Schweiz. Er, Essen eine Sch Schwanz. <laughs> so you're already in the hole. There was one uh, pre show match. And, uh, yeah. I mean, the fucking the actual pay per view is already going. <laughs> Started at 7. Thank you. Nope. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Alright, I'm back, everybody. Hey, and we got pulled pork sandwiches and. It's going to be the most awkward two or three minutes of a podcast you've ever heard. 
I almost want to wait till them guys are done eating before I even start, so at least somebody will be fucking talking. <laughs> so, uh... I could talk. <laughs> <laughs> we no. wing, Wiz. Welcome to Wrestling's High Marks with G Wiz. <laughs> Meet Jabba Man. Jabba 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 G Wiz. Meet Joe. Meet Joe. Jabba Jabba Jabba. Jabba Jabba. Obi KB. That's the Meat Man. <gasps> Quick shout out <laughs> to my lovely lady Amanda for putting this meal together for us. Also, quick shout out to Sweet Baby Ray's for being the only barbecue sauce that matters. Yes. Uh, look How at how is Mach Gallows not being Luke disqualified? Gallo. Mach Gallows. <laughs> yep. This is Macho Man Luke Gallows? Randy Gallows. Mach Gallows has been <laughs> kicking Slash Wilder's butt this whole match. <laughs> He's like uh, trying to steal Triple H's gimmick. <laughs> now he's bashed Wilder. Like, no, dumbass, it wasn't a hand sledge, it was a full size sledgehammer. <laughs> Hold on, how did Triple H hit people with a full size sledgehammer? Well, the trick is you miss them by a mile and make it look really stupid. Oh, mm. okay. Oh, uh, here comes a triple jump moonsault. No? Huh. No? Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't know. I thought maybe. Yeah. All right. Those dudes definitely like moonsault type of guys. They both look like the type, for sure. No, you're not slamming me on the chair. Fuck you. So how's the food? And you can be honest. If it's awful, just say so. No, shit was good. It's <laughs> awesome. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you, Amanda. I'm sure she won't listen, but thank you, Amanda. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Could you blame a woman for not listening to the show? Would you be mad? I mean, seriously. I'm like, that's okay. I don't want to watch uh, The Notebook, for example. So, I mean, mm -hmm. certain things are made for certain people. Jesse doesn't listen to the show, and she's been on the fucking show. <laughs> right. And she, like, really likes us and thinks we're really cool people. So it's like, if even that's not enough, <laughs> I'm still not mad. I told her we'll be live tonight at Mixler. I'll send her a link. She's like, well, maybe if I can get, like, a headphone in and escape to the bathroom and get high. Because, <laughs> mm -mm -mm. you know, she got, like, four kids. You got to have the well, coleslaw, man. God. Hey, as, as bad as we like are it, it really and everything, for me. and as derogatory as we can be sometimes, at least we're not Alabama <laughs> or Ohio. <laughs> mm -hmm. so, so we got that going for us, ladies. True enough. Yep. No Alabama here. I or even worse, like Ohio. Ohio. I mean, granted, I'm a little bit country and he's a little bit rock and roll, but still. <laughs> a little bit country. <laughs> I'm a little bit cock and holes. <laughs> mm. Damn. Speaking of cock and balls. Welcome back, Burbs. How fucking great was it to have a Burbs this week? Yes. Bitching with Burbs. Missed Suplex that. City Limits number 214. Check it out, people. Got an extended Burbs this week. It was almost 14 minutes of Burbs. I loved it. Hope to hear from him again soon. Yeah, we had an extended Burbs, and once I heard that, I had an extended G Wiz going for a minute. There. It was <laughs> nice. I was like, oh, yeah. I had an extended burbs erection. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have a wiener. <laughs> it eventually ended in uh, uh, burbs gasm. <laughs> or burbs max, however you'd like to say. <laughs> a cly burbs. Hey, one hour until we go Mixler live. All right. Damn, look at this dude. I've been getting a shit beat out of me. That was Bring pretty me some brutal. More. Oh, well. Damn, ah, back of the head, dude. That was his head. <laughs> he's, he's supposed Holy to get up and fuck. do more, but he's like... Arr, 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 arr. <laughs> yeah, he's like on autopilot at this point. Uh, yeah. Just caved in the back of his skull. Oh, damn. Oh. Spit right in that dude's eye. Luke Gallows just spit right in Luke Gallows' eye. <laughs> Oof. 
Dude, this that some... might be the end of Slash Wilder. Rough ass chair shot. This shots. is like, yeah, this is some brutal chair shot action. Yo, no, man, you lost. What a fucking loser. It does say mercifully, too. Mm hmm. My turn to momentarily disappear while I put some <laughs> fresh water in Albert. No problem. I'm just loving the same. Here sandwich. comes bigger boss man. I have never ate on a bigger. podcast before, but I'm not. I don't feel bad for it. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. This is some good shit. I'm done, but it's good shit. Hey, uh, if Tommy Dreamer can eat pizza. Pretzel rods and pizza on serious radio. Pretzel rods. That's a terrible. Actually, those are both not good things to eat on the air. <laughs> pizza and pretzel rods. They're both like kind of noisy in their own way. Dang you, Tommy Dreamer. Simon. Oh, Simon saving. saving Wiz goes day. out, cheese man comes back in. <laughs> What's why? Simon doing? That's why. It said queer. I seen I seen the word queer. Damn it. I wish I'd have seen that quicker. <laughs> said little I fucker won't take radio. any crap from you, Bud Bundy. <coughs> I'll Go back to being irrelevant. Out, out the ring. That's why. Crutchner. <laughs> good. 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 <laughs> I'm watching you make stools. <laughs> Is Simon gonna shake hands with Slash Wilder? No, Slash Wilder's not having it. When my hand goes up, hand. your mouth goes shut. <laughs> <laughs> Crotchner and his distant stares into nothingness. <laughs> Dog's got a lot on his mind. Man, that's heavy. John Klinger versus Simon Miller. I'm going to probably watch that. Why <laughs> is why? Only 17 <clears throat> pounds and 50. What do they call their cents over there? Pence. Pence? Okay. Oh, shit. Is it's that dick silver dust. dust? Or, oh, dick dust. Yeah, that's dick dust. That's dick dust and, uh, boily. <laughs> <laughs> boily. <laughs> I don't know who came up Pronounced with that. Pronounced with Probably me, mark. I'm guessing. <laughs> no, that but, wasn't me. But that's funny. <laughs> boily is... The win. Yeah, B is for boy. Question mark. It's <laughs> way better than Ruby Riot's little sister or whatever I said. <laughs> it's way better. Boy I thought boy. that was somebody else that was the Ruby Riot. Okay. Oh, there's <laughs> there's Kane's skinny like cousin. <laughs> Kane's illegitimate son. Len Jacobs. <laughs> <laughs> Ben Jacobs? Ben's mm. good, too. Yeah. There you go. Ben Jacobs. Jacobs. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to use the top of your uh, sour buddies here to break up some marijuana. <laughs> sour buddies. That's fine. Not to be confused with bears, because that would be copyright infringement. No, I think they're supposed to be Sour Patch Kids. Oh. Not to be confused with Patch kids, because that would be copyright infringement. Mm -hmm. Yep. So the pre-show thing you were talking about—it was what again? Uh, the Usos versus Daniel Bryan and uh, well, Captain Planet and Wheeler. And they lost. Usos won. Damn it. Yep. You were the only one that picked the uh, trees. Yeah, the trees. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the trees got chopped down today. <laughs> Ooh, souls. And the women's uh, Money in the Bank match is going on right now. And so. here are my chances of winning. 
Timber! <laughs> Natalie Sykes. The good thing is when we're live on fucking uh, Mixler, we're not exactly doing a watch long because we'll be going back to catch up on shit and then fast forwarding between bullshit. What mm -hmm. the shits? Oh, it's fucking uh, Molly Holly's da <laughs> or Bob Holly's or Spark Plug Holly's daughter. Daughter. It's my new favorite. That's for sure. <laughs> That's what I was getting the, at. I was like, hey. That's the new bar second. that's been. Uh, the bar has yeah. just been lifted. The, the bar has been raised. Yeah, that's the one from a couple weeks ago when I was like, I didn't know Spark Plug or Sparky Plug Sparky had a daughter. Plug, you did say that. Lizzie Styles. Lizzie Styles. Styles. <laughs> Lizzie Styles. Oh, Styles crash. You think you're ready? You are ready for Rizzy Riles? Oh, here comes Rizzy Styles. Ah, uh, not time Rockery. Hello, Rizzy. Mm -hmm. Stupid bastard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is very good. <laughs> the current two PI <coughs> in wrestling women's champion. Yep. Oh, excuse, priest. <laughs> <laughs> Forgiveness, priest. <laughs> Are you the girls champion? So I think Paige may have muted me because she bitch hasn't blocked me still. She came out saying something because like people were like saying so much shit about the Kabuki Warriors name, and she's like, "The girls picked it. They liked it. There, Get over it. It's a name." No way. And I'm like, "Oh well, my god! At least I it was our joke on some other podcast. Really? I forget who it was, but somebody made the page. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, well, at least it wasn't Bukaki Warriors." Yes, right exactly. <laughs> but you Still guys heard blocked. that joke, that 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 terrible joke from us first. Yeah. Yeah. I made that joke on Twitter first, damn it. And, and if anyone heard that, that was cheeses. And used it, I'll call it an homage <laughs> and be honored. How's that sound? Yep. Shout out Andy the Tank if he even listens. <laughs> he hit me up with a uh, private message, give me props on it. He fucking hates Paige as much as we do. <laughs> so. Well, she's awful at every Everything. aspect of what she does. I was like, why the, hell? Why the fuck is she the mouthpiece for anybody? Yeah, it's not like no. we're assholes. We're just, uh, we watch wrestling. <laughs> yeah, we have working eyes and ears. Yeah. Sorry, Bobby, no offense. Oh, goddamn. Fucking stomped the shit out of her just now. <laughs> All you gotta do is have fucking working ears and not like Paige. Paige hair. <laughs> I try to never miss those for you. Oh, I've been practicing. <laughs> I'm outing my belt. <laughs> the funny thing is, if you've seen the video, then you know the I've been practicing is in reference to her shoving a vibrator in her ass. Oh. <laughs> uh, I've so, been would, would putting Paige with the Iconics been overkill? Like, I know or, or would that be them doing us a favor so <laughs> all the annoying voices would only be at that one segment? Right. Of the it, show. <laughs> that match was so poor, I actually enjoyed the Iconics on uh, commentary. commentary. <laughs> and just when you think they're a trio, here comes Vicky Guerrero to hang out with them, too. And I'm just like, oh, God. Excuse me. Excuse me. I miss Vicky Guerrero. There was a fucking general manager. That was someone who knew how to play the part and do it right. And if you're the kind of dude who's into, like, chubby old ladies, that was, like, your shit. Yeah, you know, your shit. It's like, man, she's fucking spot on. If you're into that you like sort those of little thing. extra <laughs> ripples in the thighs? She's right. your girl. Hey, this was before <laughs> we had right. had, yeah, had C do. <laughs> oh, that was kind of looked like a fuck up to. <laughs> she oh. need her right in the mouth. Go sleep, bitch. Spark plug out. Sleepy times. <laughs> it's like, how dare you botch two? We call that somebody needs a tune up. So we call that breaking off the spark plug in the head. <laughs> Someone turn right when they should turn left. I'm sorry that I blew two straight moves. It's okay. I'm just going to shoot me in the mouth now. Lizzie Starles filed embalming? What? <laughs> These are some weird no. captions here. Well, probably it's even worse because of the accents. To where it's just like, it's fucking up the caption program. I... <laughs> It's fucking embarrassing! <laughs> <coughs> oh, 
<coughs> Between regular ass weed <coughs> and old ass fucking <coughs> Albert here, I'm gonna die. Well, we can do devs later, or even now if you guys want. But you know, I figured the, the earlier we do it, the more it'll ruin the show. <laughs> yeah, later. we should be doing dabs till about halfway through. I mean, like, I, 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 I mean, I can dab all day and I'll be perfectly fine. But <coughs> I know that it has a heavier yeah. effect on people that don't do it all the time. I've seen it over and over again, dude. I've knocked people out before. <laughs> I hospitalized a guy. I've had to take that seat. Start feeling that lightheadedness. Ooh, head's feeling a little hot. <laughs> oh, so you've been to some of Wiz's Bill Cosby parties? <laughs> yes, yes, I have. It's called the Cos. It's it's cool though. I knew it was drugged when I ate the fucking pudding. Yeah. And yeah. I knew it wasn't all just pudding. I mean, he asked me if I would add extra drugs in his because he comes to all the parties and he's getting used to. It. Two of the normal strength roofies. Right. Like, you step it up, Adach. Oh, here come the roofies. You can do whatever you want to be. <laughs> so that guy that we were calling Flores. Mach Gallows. Yeah. Is Wait, really Flores. John Klinger. And you might not think anything, but that's just British for crotch critters. Oh, neat. That, that's the American translation. John that's, Clingers? That's what I'm doing from now on. I'm putting roofies in Oreos and calling them Florios. There you go. <laughs> or you it's the new could, seasonal flavor. Or you could put roofies yeah, in Yeah, baby. Your These are just call Oreos Florida from Florida. Ah, well played. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that's what it stands for. Florida Oreos. <laughs> yeah. Florios. Papa Sing Pot? <coughs> I'm gonna I'm mix Rasa? ecstasy in my Oreos and they'll be Horios. Yeah. Thirstios. <laughs> Works on two levels. Horny as hell. Haskins. Thirsty as fuck. You gotta, you gotta drink when you're on ecstasy. Took ecstasy once. It wasn't for me. Oh, you guys hear the impact news? Oh, that um, they never really signed Jordan Grace, and she's been working. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I see. Like, I read that, and then someone was like, and Jordan then, asked for her release, and it's like she can't ask for a release, so she ain't her contract, ass hat. That yeah, they've she, been actually trying to get a hold of her and really wanting to sign. A release. She asked for a contract. <laughs> you goofball. <laughs> but evidently... They don't have the money. This isn't kind of surprising. <coughs> after I found out that... <coughs> did you know that Killer Cross and Scarlet Bardot are a thing? Oh, no, I didn't know they were a thing. I knew uh, that, they both want their fucking release. Yeah, but that didn't come... To I know they were fucking. After I found out that they were actually up. Ah. Who else in wrestling needs a release more than Killer Cross right now? <laughs> He's one of the best wrestlers on the planet for all aspects of the game. Yeah. He has the look. He's got the in ring and the talking is top notch. So I mean, he should be somewhere else. I think. He was part of uh, what Especially we were able to see on Impact gonna... this week. He deserves a payday. Oh, uh, the uh, yeah, evidently they found Impact. out that he wasn't even it. making. Starting NXT pay. Yeah, I know. He's not making dick, and he's like one of the best wrestlers on the planet, as far as like all around character, and ring skill. <laughs> and I, uh, y y you have to think he could get a job any place right now. Yeah, even WWE would take him. I'm sure. I don't see why not. Dude's he's fucking great. killer on the mic. No pun intended, or maybe the pun was intended. I don't know. I could listen to that guy read the newspaper. <laughs> no, uh, the only match I really, the only re match I really did see this week from Impact was uh, Cross vs. Eddie because that's how it started off. The fir uh, for some reason on the hack site this week, part one was last week's fucking part one for Impact, but part two was for this week. So I watched a little <laughs> bit of that. 
And uh, oh, I, Killer Cross I beat the hell out of uh, Eddie Edwards. And then uh, after he picked up the win, he zip tied Eddie's ass to the ropes, and then wound up with Kenny like he was gonna beat him with Kenny, and instead pulled up short and cracked Kenny in half over his leg, and left Eddie fucking like freaking out and screaming while he was tied to the ropes. Kenny, Kenny, no! <laughs> He Cross just kind of sat there, reveled in his like fucking misery, you know. And and then just then, Kyle from South Park <laughs> yeah. walked by and was like, "Oh my God, you killed Kenny!" And then Stan you came bastard. out and said, "You bastard!" <laughs> hey, wait, no, it's, you it's son Stan. of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> you should know better than anybody. <laughs> hey, look, they just signed a contract. <laughs> <coughs> Rampage Haskins. <coughs> he held, he's holding it up. See Impact? See Impact? This is what you do. You actually sign contracts. <laughs> you joke of a fucking company. You. Why sign a contract when you can play another replay? <laughs> okay, he has a NWO <laughs> style lo logo t shirt, but it says EHM. You're only allowed to change one letter in that, if you ask me. You have to have, like, at least a W-O and just, like, only change the first thing or something. If you use all your own, it's just nope. an unoriginal design. <laughs> the unoriginal piece of repeating shit? Yeah. It, 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 it should be the Andradov World Order or whatever his name is. Setting this down for a minute. This shit's choking the hell out of me. Andrusev, I meant. Andrade, A W O, <laughs> right? That's how you do it. You don't change all the letters, because then it's just stupid. <coughs> Ram <coughs> Page. <coughs> Man, I feel bad for Page because he looks pretty big. <coughs> don't feel bad for Page. Never feel bad for Page. <laughs> Not that page. Ah! <laughs> you want to be a man? Put it on the line and let's find out who wants it more. <laughs> who wants it more oil? Sorry. Yeah, that dude's in the air of that dude's huge. She be popping in like, turn here. <laughs> he gave him the metal finger. Oh, he the set bird. Us, he said, I swear. He flipped him the bird. <laughs> And then Brody Coyle slipped him the tongue. Because that's what Paige would do. We're not half bad at this British accent nonsense, are we? <laughs> no. W not the greatest, but not terrible. Every bit as limey as that Nigel bastard on NXT. <laughs> or that fucker Luke Batch. <laughs> <laughs> you fuck Luke Batch. <laughs> Luke Batch? More like Luke Batch. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why I found that so great. <laughs> <laughs> Rampage oh. taking everybody out. She's upset. Her old man's dead. And <laughs> so is Jinder's cousin or uncle or whatever. Oh, that guy's name's Coil, and that's why oil popped up a bunch of times. I get it now. Uh -huh. Wait, isn't he the video nasty? He is. He is. Oh, the, yeah. yeah, that's the one that used to fuck Paige. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> she just rip off her wedding ring. <laughs> yeah, no. what exactly is going on with her? Hot <coughs> camera chick. He is wearing the same everything, dude. I think they do multiple episodes in a day. I hope so. Cause, uh, well, either that or I ain't eating it. <laughs> I am not eating at the restaurant. <laughs> the health department said no. <laughs> <laughs> well, first of all, why'd you put the dumper right by the snack bar? Okay. Man, I really hope this fan was obnoxious, because at no point in, during this did we ever turn it off. Yeah, that's true. We just left it on like, fuck it. That's all right, though. Fuck them. It's setting a baseline for us. 
It's the white noise in the background. Yep. Oh, look, he's got the video camera out. I'm about to fuck your girl raw right here in the ring. You're gonna watch. Oh, damn. <clears throat> <And> I'm gonna <laughs> take Rampage's belts over there. And I'm gonna fucking. <clears throat> oh, look at the, the fucking. The handcuffs broke. <laughs> oh, my God, really? Oh. Yeah. Awesome. He had to hold him. Just pile drived his woman. Yep. Right in front of him. Pile drived his old lady. Took her to Pound Town. Gave her the rampage. Like, now it's my turn to pile drive her. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Pound Town, population you ho. <laughs> <laughs> population you. We're out of time. <laughs> oh, that's it? Yep. <laughs> no shit. Took her to Pound Town and uh, hopped on the fuck truck and got the hell out of there. Well, fuck. What are we going to do for a half hour? Catch up on fucking the pay-per-view. Oh. Yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> and that concludes our watch along. Uh, Mojo gets the victory. Bailey picks up the win Bailey, and she is Bailey, Miss Money Bailey. in the Bank. <laughs> You know, and it didn't know what to think there at the end. It was a, I, I liked the match. It was this a was fucking a good match. Fucking These amazing. These girls beat the Great hell match. out of each other. I mean, sure, maybe they took some bumps harder than they should have because they fucked up, but it still looked great. Huh. And yes, I'll admit openly that I thought the Carmella injury was real and that she came back. And it looked pretty and damn legit, but then when they kept showing the camera on her going yeah. to the back, that's when I was like, eh, she might do the old run down at the end and surprise victory. She did the run down, but she didn't get the win. And sure enough, it happened. Uh, but yeah, Bailey, we'll take it. And we we'll take it. Maybe, maybe she was sick getting rewarded eclipse. for not not going the Sasha route. Perhaps. But either way, she's was overdue. I thought. Yeah, really good match. Yeah. Sorry, we got caught watching the replay. <laughs> okay. Man, well, did um, Eddie Jr. look happy or what? <laughs> uh, yeah. Samoa Joe has a broken nose that's legitimate. <laughs> and Rey Mysterio is the new, new United US States champion, champion. That's that legitimate we. Too. Like two minutes. What the fuck? That was quick as fuck. None of us called that. And no, no, no we did not. The pin was as shady as uh, Ronda Rousey. We're watching pin, if not worse. now. If you look at Joe's shoulder, it was never down ever. Yeah, Joe's shoulder was not down. I don't mean it wasn't all the way down on the three count. I mean it never yeah, touched. There was the only mat. one shoulder down the entire time. Yes. <laughs> that was stupid. Boy, we are not. Doing well at all when it comes to picking this shit. Shane O'Mac picks up the victory in the yeah, match. He gives Miz the slip. None of us chose that outcome. His sweaty ass pays off in the end as he just slides Again, right out of his shirt. Whip another one of those. Shane wins by dumb luck. Yeah. Shane took a couple of pretty nifty bumps. I'll give him credit for that. Jesus God. The, the one off the top of the cage was fucking perfect. I really thought they were going to give this to Miz. What? So does this mean they're going to extend this, or is just Shane gets the upper hand and fuck you, Miz? Time to go do your own thing. So Tony Nice picks we're up the We're finally win. redeemed. Yeah, we actually all three get this one right. <laughs> we got all aboard one right. the Tony train. <laughs> And a shout out to Jack the Jobber from Cultaholic who chose Tony Nice mm -hmm. as well. Yeah, he wins with a uh, basically a running knee to the face. Reasonably quick match, but with lots of stiffness, as you'd expect from uh, these guys. Yeah. Jesus Christ, that guy's a stack of bricks. Yeah, Tony Nice is fucking stacked for sure. <laughs> but enough about his penis. And they got a purple belt, so. But, but enough, enough about, about his, his penis. penis. So, Becky retains against Lacey Evans. And she remains and Becky Two Belts, at least for some time. Yeah, she for now will for sure be Raw Women's Champion come tomorrow. And so far, no Bailey. Yeah, no Bailey so far. 
She so, might wait until after the Charlotte. This uh, this wasn't the best match. I don't know what the hell that was. Okay. Yeah, this wasn't a wasn't a great match, unfortunately. I'm kind of Corey bummed was because I, to, kind of a surprise even because of the two people that are in it. Yeah. I loved Lacey. Argue for Lacey and was counting when the referee was making sure Becky's shoulders were down. Yeah. And Corey's like, four, five. Uh, well, let's have Becky wins this one. We all picked that to happen, I believe. Oh, here's oh, Bailey. What's going on now? <laughs> oh, Charlotte. She's she got to fight Charlotte right now, now, too? Huh. <laughs> Interesting. It's okay. We picked Charlotte to win against Becky. So, Really? Right now? Well, now, see, if the match happens now, I actually have less faith that Charlotte's going to win. I feel like Becky's going to pull it out now. No, well, she's, uh... I guess we'll find out, because this shit's about to happen. She took off her robe. It's, go it's going down for real. <laughs> oh, my God, it's happening. I'm sorry, this is a song. Yeah, yeah, I actually know that song now. Chuckles the Clown. Did you stop that shit? Did you stop that shit? Oh, no, I didn't. <laughs> Well, that's not even right. That's Meltzer's daughter. He just stopped shaving. That's not even women's right. Okay. Uh, so, so, Charlotte, I get, yeah, let's uh, we'll watch this replay. We now me and Cheese are even interference. up. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, Lacey comes down and lands a woman's right. And then a big boot. And a one, two, two three. For Charlotte Flair. So, Charlotte Flair, your new With, uh, assist from SmackDown Lacey Women's Evans. Champion. Well, I feel like this needed to be done to kind of like even out the shows and shit, and it was cool her holding the belts for that long. It's a nice accomplishment to be on her that you know, and record and whatnot. And isn't Lacey on Raw? And they can yeah. continue their feud. And yep. nobody really looks weak. Oh. Right? In that, Lacey's like, titties trying to pop out, and she's trying to keep it from start, from popping out. She was holding it with both hands, just getting wailed on. <laughs> it was hilarious. She's still getting wailed on. That's like eight knees to the face. Charlotte, fuck off. Oh, come on. Let her beat her down, you dumb blonde bitch. And we're back. Well, yeah, <laughs> Bailey time. cashed in. Bailey comes down for the save and then ends up... So, do I get a <laughs> point for that? <laughs> the hugger no. section goes nuts. <laughs> I, I did say that. No. No. <laughs> no, no, no point. Man, I can't believe they did that but shit that would, two years in a row. I'm not probably happy come about into that. play in a tiebreaker situation. Fair enough. And I am tied with the motherfucker. But yeah, because me and Cheese are tied right now. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, Bailey is your SmackDown Women's Champion. Uh huh. Okay. Well, and, uh, so he was trying to win. Are we caught up? Does that give Charlotte like the shortest women's so, title so, reign ever? Probably. Dave wants to know if this is a pay-per-view watch along. In a way, it is. It is, but we're I don't not know actually if we're... caught up to live yet. But yeah. But, soon, probably not. Yeah, since they usually have a bunch of stuff in between. <coughs> it's Elias, but we can't really hear him, so I'm going to skip the talking part. Yeah, he's going to be fighting Roman Reigns anyway, so... We're close to live now, for sure, but it's on. Oh, look, wow. it's already over. I, I Roman Reigns won. A couple minutes would be okay, mm -hmm. but I guess not. All right, well. So we're on Elias versus... Is that after the match? Okay, this is confusing as fuck. No, it was before the match. Okay. I don't know. He probably said something like, I'm leaving. And then Roman Reigns Two, came out and said, three. fuck your well, mouth, and I went. that he won, but at least why? Um, he threw him in the ring. He was well, trying to leave. Superman punch and spear. <laughs> Pretty much. Oh, oh wow. no, he's just going straight Pretty much spear. you called it. No Superman well, punch. that was outside of the ring. Oh, yeah. That's probably what he laid him out with. Okay. Okay. All right. And yes, Roman Reigns will pick up the win. That's... All right. And uh, Seth Rollins, after, I don't know, kicking out of 100 pin falls, and AJ kicking out of 99. <laughs> <laughs> 
finally picks up the win. Hundredth pins the charm. Yep. Jeez. The match that would never end ended, and uh, Rollins is your winner, as we all three chose, so no drama there. Yeah, Rollins retains is still your universal champion. And, and uh, uh, for, for those who are listening along live on Mixler, there's quite a bit of moisture going on in the room right now, from what I'm told. So, yes, drip, drip, drip. <laughs> MLW doesn't come on until. Yeah, yeah, who didn't know Kofi was gonna win this match? Honestly, we all picked him. Yep, yep. Yeah, if so we all picked him, then it's really clearly obvious because we suck. Time, we really haven't missed anything. Mm. Nope. Ugh. That, that was so, pretty good, actually. Yeah, uh, yeah it was an uh, okay match. Yeah, it was a little slow. Uh, it didn't hook me really, mostly because who didn't know Kofi was gonna win this fucking match? I'm. I don't even know if I'm allowed to say anything about it. I watch so little of it. Yeah, we've been too busy fucking around the mixer chat. <laughs> Hashtag cock armor. <laughs> Hashtag cock armor. Hashtag steel tips. <laughs> Way to fucking waste building up a st angle at any point during the fucking year with either briefcase because you gave it to some fucking douche nozzle who shows up three times a year. Cool. Good call. Stop! I don't know what's worse. That Brock Lesnar... <laughs> what the hell's going on over there? Brock Lesnar <laughs> winning the Money in the Bank match. <laughs> Something way better or... on the chat than <laughs> wrestling again. Yeah, so the Mixler chat's definitely been I better than this wrestling pay-per-view. Oh, or oh, that, shit, that was Mustafa it. Ali had to yeah. stand up there with his hands on the briefcase like an idiot for an hour. I don't know which one I'd like less. Yeah. <sighs> this was fucking a bad way to end this. Yeah. He should have came out of the crowd quickly, not like had an entrance. Good job, Vince. While Ali stands at the top of the ladder with two hands on the briefcase, watching him walk down like a fucking ass clown. That was stupid. Vince's unrelenting boner for Brock Lesnar will eventually be the downfall of this fucking company. Yes. start with our Facebook shout outs and, and there's none so I'm going to hit the crickets right now it's fucking embarrassing did anybody get us on the gram this week Mojo actually two. aim at the mic <laughs> <laughs> caught you Ty Hill 2005 oh thank you for the follow sir and Mr. Captain Romance <laughs> you stealing my nickname <laughs> thank you for the follow sir and then we also got a cool co comment from Silver Serpent. Oh, that is sensible saying. That's also sexable saying. Sexable saying. Hashtag sexable saying. Hashtag nips to tips. <laughs> All right. And uh, how do we do on Twitter this week? We got two episodes to kind of cover the retweets on this should be fun yeah for uh last week's episode episode 57 we got retweets from vic hey and tht oh yeah back in a sec mm -hmm. let's see trying to find midweek munchies here we go we got retweets from oh well, vic nice again list. shout out vic yuck nasty oh that's nasty Transcontinental Project. Hey, that's Luke and Sam. Yep. Also Luke. And shout out Luke. Thank also you, Sam. Sam. Look at you doing it with the company page and the personals. Much love to you. Yep, two of you responsible for three shout outs. Well done. <laughs> Quantity and quality. You know it. And that's it for Twitter. So that leaves the regulators. Regulators. Mount something. Indeed. All right, Mount well. something. Well, he's in the room right now, the guy we like to start things off with. Let's give it up for Stephen Millen! Stephen Millen! Stephen Millen! Stephen Millen! Stephen Millen! 
Thanks for showing up in the chat tonight, Steve. Mound up, says Sensible Sam. I was thinking the same thing. Uh, that's why we are working on that airfare. <laughs> yes. Hashtag go fund me. Or hey. go fuck me. And of course, Sensible Sam, why not make her next? We're talking about her and yeah. Luke Birch. And you can check out their show, The Trans Continental Project. I like my continental projects like I like my porn. Trans. Check them out. It's a great show. Yes, they are. And this week we had a fucking very great return from It's Your Boy, Burbs. He is back in effect. Burbs. There is a bitchin' <laughs> with Burbs. Check him out on Suplex City Limits. That's number 214. Uh, God, what a treat. Extended uh, Burbs. Of course. Shout out to Vic. Oh, yeah. That's Vic. At Psycho Psychic on Twitter. I like both of those, and when you put them together, it's just, it's almost too much. <laughs> and then THT Podcast, a box man of Shaheen. Those guys. As well as Nuclear Heat Graphics. Don't forget about that. Yeah, don't forget about Nuclear Heat Graphics. Check out all Shaheen shit. Got some good stuff on there, and it's reasonably priced. Uh, wrestling Soup. Uh, Mish, Joey, and John, of yeah. course. The Legends. Uh, Don, Tony, and Kevin Castle show. Check them out. The Inhuman Experience. Oh. Bobby and Bobby. As far as we know, Bobby <laughs> Anthem's in the room still. I'm pretty sure he's in there. Uh, Shout out Bobby Anthem and Bobby Blades. Check out the Inhuman Experience. I love that show. Great show. Indeed, indeed. Next we got Get in the Corner with Yuck and Dog Baby. A fucking corner. I, I, I believe the show's on a break right now until sometime in the summer, which is a shame, but they will be back. And then, uh, who knows, maybe they, every now and then they'll do a little special thing and kind of randomly pop up on us. Sure do love you guys. Yep, shout out to them anyway. Indeed. <laughs> Uh, Suplex City Limits. Ah, we kind of covered that, but yep. Jim and Tyler holding it down. Smoking marijuana while covering wrestling. The WNC Super, Super Party. Super Party. Good Papa Dave. It's, uh, yeah, he's no longer in the room. He's eating chicken with dressing. Yep. Good for him. Good for him. Oh, it's after the summer. Internally basted chicken. Uh, uh, Luke chimed in with Get in the corner We'll be back after the summer so Makes sense Sometime in the fall then. And don't forget to check out Jason Solomon Solomon Oscar signs off yeah, That guy needs a couple of views No one's heard of him He just had his 600th episode Oh He's actually an industry giant Industry giant My fault Yep He's only been around forever And then uh, Yeah we already got the Transcontinental Project So but you can't shout them out enough. At least I can't. I'm like addicted to that shit right now. <laughs> and our boy, MF Spade. Thanks again for coming on last week. Hey, we have a new joint. Who just uh, joined the room there? What's that say? Demetrius Shy. Demetrius Shy. And a uh, quick shout out before we end the segment to Demetrius Shy. who just came in. Yeah. I hope you enjoy the last six minutes of what we're going to do here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, shit. All right, well, with that, I think episode 58 of Wrestling's High Marks is just about cached. I would certainly think so. I've been your host, Mon- Monster Cheese Man, joined along with... More join the go go but go go from the Lando Corinthian Afro Sheen Lima Bean Tapioca Island Cup of Cocoa Jojo. And I'm G Wiz Willoughby. <laughs> Remember to check us out on Facebook. That's Facebook.com slash the high marks. Like anyone's gonna do that. <laughs> or on Twitter, which is entirely more likely, at twitter.com slash the high marks. You can also get us on the gram. That's Instagram.com slash the high marks. You can get the audio version of the show on anchor.fm slash the high marks. And that's usually up before anything else if you want to be firsties. Uh, you can listen to us on Podcoin and make more money to listen than we make to make the damn show. And uh, I think that covers everything, right? Did I miss something? All right, yeah. Uh, we're going to have our guy Dimitri Martin take us out this week, which will be new to me. I'm hearing it new the same time you are. 
Uh, so if there is nothing else, gentlemen. No. Nope. Take us out, Dimitri. I think they could probably bring fajitas out from the kitchen a little bit later. That's the whole joke. That's it. That's a smoke-based joke. It's just how the fajitas are smoking and stuff. That's okay. No Felchin Belgian on this episode Aww. or Justin Jism. No Jism or Felchin Belgians? Fuck. Ignorant! Change it! Grab the kitchen sink from under the the ring, Robix. Mm. Yeah, Robix. Ignorant! Change it! Brown. 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 Brown Strauman. Ignorant! Change it! It's your boy, Babs! He is back in effect. Babs! Ignorant! Change it! Dimitri is a tree where stakes grow. Cool. It's Dimitri. And we are officially the done recording now. Tree. Ignorant! Change it! No Felch in Belgian. I'm sorry, I wasn't at the microphone at the time.